Hello all, so today, super quick video. Um, ran into a problem the other day where I needed to charge my AC and uh, I've got the Pittsburgh manifold set, but it's for R134A, um, which means that your charge line here is a half inch Acme thread, which does not, does not screw onto an R22 tank. Uh, the R22 tank uses a quarter, uh, uses a one quarter flare fitting. Looks similar, but um, if I compare them here, you can see the quarter flare is smaller. So, you know, there you go. Let's try the straight side. There we go. So that works great. Um, but, you know, I didn't want to wait for a R22 gauge set to show up. And considering with the Harbor Freight set, they give you two, they give you two quarter flare lines and one uh, half inch Acme line uh, for your 134 tank. And then in the in the kit, you have you know your gauges, and here again we have quarter flare, quarter flare, and this is the normal uh, adapter that is in the center tap here. Uh, and this is a half inch Acme thread adapter. And this is this right here is where it screws into the body. And you can see for R134, uh, they've got, you know, quarter inch flare adapters to these. So I needed this charged. Uh, so what I ended up doing, I ran down to my local hardware store, Menards, Lowe's, uh, Home Depot, any of those guys should have it. Get yourself a quarter inch flare uh, by one eighth MIP uh, adapter, and then you can just you can unscrew the regular fitting here. Just screw that in, and be careful not to strip it out. This is an aluminum block, uh, and then what you can do from there is keep your uh, you know close off your valves. Uh, forget about the charge line. Get rid of it. Uh, hook up you know your cold or sorry, your low side to your low, and you can use your high line to go to the uh, charge port, run that into your tank, and then flip your tank over and do your charging, and make sure you only open up, only ever open up the low side. Don't, don't open the high side, otherwise you're gonna be spraying coolant out here. So yeah, that's the solution. Cost, you know, total cost was a dollar and 50 cents and I was able to charge up the AC uh, yesterday instead of waiting a week for a gauge set to come in so that's all I got